Welcome back. Everyone here in Green Country has been talking about Osama bin Laden's death this morning. Let's go back now to 2 News reporter Dan Perlman. He's live in Midtown to tell us what people are saying. Dan? Well, we've been talking to people since early this morning. I'm guessing since about 5 o'clock. We've actually talked to about 30 people or so. And of those 30, I'd say only one had not heard about Osama bin Laden dying. Many of them were up late last night watching the coverage and the celebrations going on in Washington, D.C. and New York. Once this news broke, though, I think it's safe to say just about everyone was shocked. Unbelievable. I mean, you just had to see the headlines crawl across the screen. And then you picked up the paper this morning. It's, it's you know, the big type, like they use for, for tumultuous events. It's, it's unbelievable. I felt that they would get him someday, but, uh, you know, you, you get on busy with your life and you forget about things going on and, and how long it's been. And I was, I was surprised that it had been almost 10 years. One more thing just about everybody agreed on. Everybody said they know this is the end of a chapter in our history, but they all know we are not totally in the clear when it comes to the possibility for future terror attacks. Live in Midtown, Dan Perlman, 2 News, works for you.